We're at Kiknos, small island, 650 inhabitants. And we just woke up, had breakfast, took a little morning swim, and now we're gonna go to Syros. Nice. Does it get any more chill than this? No. Like. sail for Mykonos or some other island first and uh, the wind is calm. We just set sail. day two of sailing the Greek islands and we just woke up in Kithanos which is just off the coast of Athens and I just want to show this really cool window we have in our room it's a little window that looks right into the water everyone is having breakfast out on the deck when I go up and show you <laughs> This is our skipper Alex. And this is picture perfect Greece. Blue water, arid landscape. You have all the boats in the little bay. And a messy hair from not showering. Now we're just pulling up the anchor. We're heading to the next island, Syros. It's about a four hour sail. to Syros into a bay. We're gonna do some swimming before we head over to the port city for lunch. This is the beautiful island of Syros. How's lunch everyone? Tomorrow we're heading to Mykonos. That, that's a cool yeah. I found a fake Okay. That's, uh, the was I like your shirt. <laughs> I like your shirt and the thing. <laughs> How was that little influencer photo shoot? Got him. So we just got into the main square in the city of Syros. 
and it's really incredible because we're literally the only tourists on the entire island and it doesn't feel very packed at all it's actually quite empty and everyone around us is just greek so we're really getting a taste of like the full greek small village lifestyle We just stopped for drinks at this really cool uh, cocktail bar in this like beautiful little village square and now we're gonna head back to the boat and meet our skipper and then go to dinner in Syros. It's our one and only night in Syros. Yamas! Yamas! Thank you Alex for taking us safe here. Good to have you on board. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Alex, what is Cipro? Okay. I'm gonna taste it. Cipro, it is made from grapes. From grapes, grapes. Yeah. okay. It's, uh, it's, it's super white wine. wine. It's always artificial. Really? This is yeah, this is the real deal. Yeah. It's extra white wine. Yeah, No, don't drink the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you you messed up. You took the whole thing. Uh, You're supposed salad, to take a little sip. It was good. Oh, okay, it tastes like. I had a little sip of this. Alice. What was it called? Cheese? Cigarette? I think we had cigarette. Is it some sort of yes. strong alcohol? It's not artificial. Uh, I think like it's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. That's a bad one. It smells like a taste. Thank you. It tastes like it smells. Like this with this with the. You probably clear a wall. No. <laughs> Here we have the love couple. Josie, what did you like about the Cifros? It was a tequila taste, yeah. I make it with honey and cinnamon, apple. It's uh, Michael's. I don't think it was. I didn't order this. There. Thank you. Oh, it has a go to. I'm having the veal filet with some good sauce and rice. I saw rice on the menu and I was like, yeah, I'm getting that one. So I love rice. I think this is plums or a sun dried tomatoes. Yeah, it's really good. And I'm having the lamb shoulder with fries. Mm. And it's amazing. Tomatoes. Now we're having traditional meringue from the island of Syros. Mm. This brown thing was so good. How was it? What is it? He just dropped it on here. Too much red wine for you. Good morning, everyone. Uh, it's 8.45, I think. Evan and I are out walking, taking some photos, and we're wow, going to go down nice. and take a swim. Look down there. Beautiful, beautiful ocean. Yesterday, we went out for dinner. The eight of us plus our skipper. And I went to get some drinks. Evan and I went home around one. The others were staying for one more drink. I woke up, the, they came home at like five or 5.30. They were partying until five, six in the morning in Syros. Yeah, we were pretty tired at one. So yeah. we went home. But we've been up for like an hour and a half now, since like eight yeah. or since 7.30. Nice to get up early and beat the crowds. Yeah, there's literally no one here it's like empty the one thing you notice about Syros and actually all of Greece is that there are tons of wild cats or what do you call them feral cats wild cats I don't know street cats they're all over I guess they keep the rat populations down but right now we're walking to this little beach that we found yesterday and it's these zigzag alleys of Syros which are just picture perfect I mean look at these buildings you can see these old buildings, all the old stone. I mean, the history here just must be incredible. And then you have the ocean just right over there. I think you can see it to the buildings. All the streets are made of this stone. It's very authentic and very beautiful. I'd highly recommend Syros to anyone coming to Greece. on the north side of Syros where you can swim. You can actually see someone down there swimming. And it's already probably like 80 degrees Fahrenheit, which is, I don't 28. know, 28 degrees Celsius. 
<laughs> and we walked awesome. along here last night and it was absolutely as you if you look here you can imagine how beautiful this was with the lights and the candles and stuff overlooking the ocean but uh, we just wanted to come and see it for ourselves today you can see a lot of people swimming there actually yeah Love vacation, I must say. The water is cr crystal clear. You can, I can see your whole body. This is, this is the view. This amazing oh church. Bye. I love your shoes. I love his shoes. Look at his shoes. Yeah. Guys, <laughs> styling. <laughs> 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 